This is one of the easiest ways to make hard boiled eggs in a truck if you're a long haul driver. So I got my air fryer here. Turn it on, go to air fry, and adjust the temperature to 275 degrees Fahrenheit. And then the timer, we're gonna set the timer for 15 minutes. Just like that, we're gonna let it preheat. And we're gonna turn off the turn reminder. We're gonna start and let that preheat. Okay, so once that's preheated, very, very simple. I'm gonna take our eggs. We're just gonna put them right onto the tray. Just like that. And very carefully, we're just gonna slide them back in here like this. That's it. Now we wait 15 minutes. Okay, there's our 15 minutes up. At this point, I normally just let them sit there and rest and cool off. And then once they're cool enough, I'll show you how easy these things are to peel. Okay, so we got our eggs here. They're uh, they cooled off now. I'm gonna show you just how easy these things are to peel. Look at that thing. The shell just comes off so easily. chunks and of course you get a little bit of small ones here and there but other than that that's a perfect little egg Look at that. perfectly cooked in the center it's all good easy to do virtually no mess and uh, nothing to clean up afterwards you just peel it off into the garbage and uh, you're good to go air fryers have uh, really changed the way I eat in the truck and cook in the truck. I don't eat fast food anymore. I avoid truck stop food. Everything I make is all uh, in the truck. I, once a week I'll stop at the grocery store and I'll pick up fresh chicken and beef, steaks, roasts, eggs, and then put it all in the air fryer and uh, it's really changed the uh, my diet on the road. Look at that, just super easy. And the one thing you don't want to do is you don't want to hit it on a sharp edge or even too hard with your with your hand because then you break up these little pieces and you then you got some little little pieces here that go into the egg white. You got to kind of takes a little bit more to get those out of the those clean just look how easy this is coming off look at that just one 
big chunk of the goes. There's another one all ready to eat. You don't have to waste your water. You don't have to worry about timing it right. Some people put them into an ice bath when uh, when they're done cooking. I just let it sit and rest in the uh, in the air fryer tray until it cooled off. Or if you want a little bit sooner, you can put them into your electric cooler. I got a little 12 volt electric cooler here in the truck. Or if you got a fridge in your truck, just throw them in the fridge for a little bit. Look at this. Look at that. Just all one big piece right off. Trying to be gentle not to break the egg and shell into a thousand pieces just to make it easier to take the shell off. <laughs> Literally, that easy. Done.